Chris Brown and Drake, uh, they they're included in a growing list of people that uh, want to slew, uh, you know, sue each other over the June incident at WIP nightclub in New York that um, basically turned out in a bottle tossing brawl. What happened is that the two stars are suing each other, uh, each claiming that the other guy started the fight. Basically, uh, what they were talking about is legal documents filed by lawyers for Brown and Drizzy, in which they asked the judge in the case to blame the other for the brawl. You know, both claimed they were not responsible for the fight and would like the other party to pay for damages in the event that uh, one of the alleged victims in the case uh, wins this lawsuit. And uh, basically, a French model, Romain Jolien, is suing both men in August, claiming he suffered severe tendon, uh, severed tendon in his right hand, as well as lacerations from broken glass, uh, cosmetic deformity, and the mental distress following the fight. Uh, to date, no criminal charges have been filed in the June 14th melee, uh, who also left NBA star Tony Parker with injuries. Uh, he's the San Antonio Spur guard. He yeah, filed a $20 million lawsuit against the club owners in the week after the incident, claiming he suffered a cameo laceration in his left eye and other injuries. Uh, both Brown and Drake were not named in that suit. But the uh, spokespeople for the singers, they could not be reached for comment at the press time. And uh, basically what happened is the club owners have filed a lawsuit against Drake and Brown, alleging that both ordered security personnel, bodyguards, friends, and uh, their own dire entourage to join the fight, uh, which turned into a violent brawl on a massive scale. And uh, in addition, two women claimed they were hurt, and um, they have also filed a suit against the Calab. Slappy situation, Calabrian stinks.